that was all right guys i'm gonna take it to the nba because amidst all these trade trades trade rumors with the whole shebang i think lou williams is gonna have more of an immediate impact on the houston rockets than demarcus cousins is gonna have on the pelicans the rockets just added an excellent three-point shooter to an already three-point shooting central team not only that i think the lou williams addition is gonna make the rockets bench the best in the nba with Lou Williams in the game for the Lakers. The Lakers outscored their opponents by 27 points, but when he was on the bench, they were outscored by 391 points. Not only that, two players who scored the most points off the bench, Lou Williams, Eric Gordon, now teammates. Most 25 point games off the bench in the last three seasons, Lou Williams, Ryan Anderson, now teammates. Hmm. And then you take it over to New Orleans, Anthony Davis, DeMarcus Cousins are going to have to have a little bit of time sure. to get to be able to work together. Yep. I mean, Kevin Durant, Steph Curry did it, but they're two very different personalities than Boogie Cousins and Anthony Davis. Same position. Yep, exactly. And uh, the Warriors also did a little bit of recruiting for Kevin Durant when I don't know if Anthony Davis had much of a say with Boogie Cousins. Uh, so Lou so- Williams is a better player than DeMarcus Cousins? That's not what I'm saying. I'm saying he'll have a more immediate impact for the Houston Rockets than DeMarcus Cousins will for the Pelicans. I agree. And uh, taking it one step farther, if the Pelicans are to get into the postseason, the Lou Williams addition to Houston will have a bigger impact on the Western Conference playoffs because New Orleans is going to be 8, 7 seed. Even with Boogie, they're not getting past Golden State or San Antonio. But the Rockets with Lou Williams, they could go all the way. Yeah. They could go all the way. 100%. Hot takes Welcome to Summer League Daily, I'm Abby Hornacek. We're here in Las Vegas for the 2015 NBA Summer League. We'll be bringing you behind the scenes with some stories, interviews, and some of the top moments from each day. The big winners of last year's NBA season were the Golden State Warriors, who broke a 40-year drought and brought a title back to Oakland. I was lucky enough to sit down with general manager and executive of the year, Bob Myers, to find out why, even for the best team in the league, summer still matters. What is it like for you guys now to finally get that ring? To bring it home to the fan base. It did come as a surprise to some people that the Warriors were kind of the front runners, but anyone who's seen Summer League in the past would know that you guys always bring intensity, always work hard. You guys won it two years ago. When we started. Now, do you think that mentality will change at all now that you guys aren't really seen as the underdogs anymore? I don't know. So there's a lot of people here, a lot of great players. Obviously, Summer Matters. What makes Summer League so important? What makes Summer League so important, it's an opportunity for renewal. Now, where do you see the future of Summer League going, knowing that and seeing how much it's evolved in the last years? Well, what's remarkable is that we're a global property now. Joining us here today, head coach of the Sacramento Kings, George Carl. Thank you for being here with us today. My pleasure. You mentioned those two guys, Willie Cauley-Stein, you know, you guys picked up. He brings a lot of tenacity to the Kings. What else are you hoping to see from him? I'm Addie Hornacek and we're here at Octane Raceway where Sun season ticket holders are mingling with players and waiting to watch them take their skills to the racetrack. So PJ, you are the defending champion from last year and Eric and Goran in there were saying that they're coming for you. I'm about to hop in the cart right now. I'm feeling pretty good. I know I'm going to win. These guys haven't seen my driving skills, especially this guy. He knows I'm the best driver in the family. So. What are you going to do during this race, just so I know how to defend myself? I'll give you a little bit of a chance. I might set you 